Hey, I did something really stupid for the past month. Do you want to know what it was? I did 100 push-ups a day for an entire month. Why, you may ask? I really don't know. For vibes, I guess? Anyway, let's kick it off with day one. So first, I'm going to show you what the actual difference this is going to make. Like, how it will affect my body. This is what my body looks day one. I'm very out of shape. I won't lie. We have, we have a lot of work to do. 100 push-ups. God, okay. I really didn't think this through. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, here we go. Don't you know I'm Oh, I've only done 20 and I want death. Three, two, one. I'm going to go inside, have a protein shake. Ah. I made my protein shake, drank it, and then it was time for day two. Good morning, everyone. I'm only joking, it's like 5 o'clock in the day. Day 2 was fine, did my 100 push-ups, got my dad to do some as well, made my protein shake and guzzled it down. On day 3, however, things took a bit of a turn for the worse. I'm on a beach. I really don't know why. And let me tell you, the journey to this beach wasn't easy. I had to walk through an overgrown path, over a cliff, through a forest, past a toilet that was in the forest for some reason, over a stream, through a field. I then got stung by nails in said field. Ah! Fuck. Yeah, that wasn't fun. Over a fence, which I then cut my leg open on, through a famine graveyard, down the side of a cliff. Wow, look at that boy go. And then I was finally there. Yeah, it wasn't worth it. <laughs> oh, shit. I enjoyed my protein shake and looked off into the horizon, and then it was time to go again. I just realized I have to get back up there after doing 100 push ups. I really didn't think this true. <laughs> Day four and five went by with little complaints. And then it was time for an adventure on day six. I'm in a hotel. I'll explain everything that's going on in a second. I haven't eaten properly all day. I'm starving. I got myself a McDonald's, so I'm gonna have this and I will explain what's going on then. It is day five of trying to make it back home to America, starting from just one penny. <laughs> So YouTube Shorts have invited me up to Belfast for like this little meet and greet thing. It's in this bougie ass five star hotel down the road, but uh, obviously I'm not staying there. I'm, I'm a broke college student. So I'm staying at the Premier Inn down the road. And since we're alone in a hotel in Belfast, do you know what that means? I'm so awkward, oh my God. And since we're alone in a hotel room, do you know what that means? Room tour. Bed. Door. Desk. Weird spire thing. Sink. That's in the room for some reason. Toilet. Even though I'm really tired and I just want to go to sleep, uh, we still have 100 push ups to do. Yay. Holy shit, I look good in this lighting. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> so obviously, I couldn't bring my other protein that I had. I know, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. So I bought two of these in a shop. These were six pounds together. Fucking rip off. So we got chocolate and we got vanilla. I think I'm gonna go... I'm hearing shit, what the fuck? Protein chocolate tonight, we're gonna go protein chocolate. Good morning everyone. We need to go to the park, do the push-ups. Yeah, that's it. Sorry, I am actually naked. We made it to the park. God, I'm so awkward right now. Oh my God, this is excruciatingly awkward. Oh my God, there's just people everywhere here. And I also have my 850 euro camera just balancing on a tree trunk. So we still have a hundred pushups to do. I feel like this is a good spot for it. The ground's just a bit wet. I don't know what to say or do. This is just so awkward. Oh my God. Ah, I want to die. Give me one reason why I should never make a change. I didn't bring my protein check with me today because uh, let's just say I was very sick last night. So I think I'm just gonna get like a packet of ham from a supermarket or something like that. All right. <laughs> let's go to the supermarket. Give me one reason why I should never make a 
I didn't actually record much of the event, but it did go well. Here's a picture of me and Joel M together. Magician guy, 16 million followers on TikTok. Yeah, that was cool. Look how awkward I look as well. I'm just like, <laughs> picture. Day eight and nine went well until my camera fell off the table. But the tragedies weren't over on day nine as I ran out of my strawberry protein powder. Amazing grace. Day 10, I went to a wind farm. Day 11, I went back to the wind farm. Day 12, I also went back to the wind farm. I really don't know why I kept going back here. <laughs> Her little legs following you. Beautiful oh, stuff. Ew! Sorry, sorry, sorry. Ew, David! Day 13, I did the push-ups in my back garden and chowed down on some minced meat. Day 14, I did my push-ups in the front garden and then forgot to eat something after. Then it was time for day 15. I've moved to my student accommodation, so you know what that means. Oh god, I'm so awkward. Room to bed, chair, shower, toilet. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna do my push-ups now. I did my push-ups and I had a delicious vegan protein shake. Mmm. I mean, you can just see from the expression on my face how much I enjoyed it. Day 16, 17, 18, and 19, I got my push-ups done without a bother. However, on day 20, I started running into some problems. I want this challenge to be done so bad. Like, the rest of my body is just starting to feel so weak. I wake up every morning and my legs are as stiff as... I'm not going to finish that sentence. Anyway, let's get these 100 push-ups done. Yay. Amazing grace. It's day 21. I don't know why, but I decided to just go for a walk in the rain. Uh, here's some proof. Give me one good reason why I should never make a change. I've decided as well to do my push-ups in the gym today to like change up the scenery a bit. So you know what that means? Gym close. Gym close transition. Here it goes. I'm so fucking awkward, oh my god. Did that look cool? Anyway, let's go. I decided to just absolutely pump out the push-ups for the final few days until we got to day 30. Do you like what I did there? I made the whole video like one big loop. Anyways, firstly, I'm gonna be doing the 100 push-ups and then secondly, I'm gonna compare my body now to day one and see if this made a difference. God, I hope this made a difference. The 100 push-ups are done. It's now time for the grand reveal. Three, two, one. Here it is! I mean, I definitely think there's a difference in my upper body, especially my chest. Also, my arms and shoulders do look a lot bigger. Would I recommend doing this? No, absolutely not. Go to a gym and do a normal workout if you are looking to build muscle. I honestly think I'm just gonna sleep for the next week. Good night, everyone. See you in my next video. Baby.